Everybody knows that pregnancy and childbirth is assumed to be something normal. And we always say like it's a normal uh, happening, so don't pathologize it. Out of 100 women, 20 are in need of medical assistance during pregnancy or childbirth, especially in settings where there's conflict or war, uh, vast displacement, insecurity, makes it difficult for the pregnant woman to access the health care. The facilities sometimes they are looted, they are destroyed, medication is not available, so especially in our settings, the midwives, they see a lot of challenges providing the health care to the population. We are working on two main concepts at the moment. One is called a sign referral checklist, and the other one is called a double head uh, fetoscope. Are quite complementary concept because uh, both address the challenge of easier detection of a complication during pregnancy to support a quick referral to the closer healthcare center. But one uh, has more emphasis on the detection of the condition of the fetus uh, during the, the protocol of NC visit, antenatal care visit. And the other one is more a communication tool uh, that try to explain uh, both to healthcare worker and the pregnant women uh, the condition that could lead eventually to complications. We try already at the beginning to keep very low cost. The tool we are doing is not bound to electricity exactly. and, and, exactly. and the internet. So exactly. I love uh, the double head fetoscope uh, because it's a very simple tool uh, that has multiple benefit. It makes easier the detection of the heartbeat of the fetus but also give the chance uh, simultaneously for the mother, for the prank mother, to listen to the heartbeat of the baby. And also it can be used more for training purpose. If a midwife needs to coach and to train the healthcare worker on the use of this tool. I believe that the use of this new double um, fetoscope will improve or maybe even encourage the moms to attend uh, their antenatal clinics a lot more.